Now there's more than one way to split HDMI. I want to. I'm gonna show you this right here, kind of as a bonus. Uh, this right here is on my back porch, and I hadn't got no cable running to it from my satellite. This right here is doing wireless. All right, I'm gonna come back to this because I want to explain it a little bit more. I want to get to the start of the show. This right here is an HDMI splitter right here, and you see that it's got output one and output two. And this is where this is where it goes in. I broke into the video, y'all. This right here is what's coming from the dish. Now this is a DVD player, but I'm just pretending like this is a satellite receiver. But uh, this comes in from your dish, and then see, here's your, here's your uh, coming out. This right here is the HDMI coming out to the TV, and then see. That goes into this one, uh, one side. This is the input, and then this runs off to the two TVs. And one of the cords is not all that long, but the other, but the other cord is 25 foot that goes to the TV that's in the bedroom. And that's why I bought this uh, powered. You can't get away with it, with uh, not buying a powered one if it's a short distance. But, but you're probably better off just going to get this kind right here, no matter what. Man, we love this right here. I I tried doing it with a splitter, using this right here. And one TV will play good, and, and one TV will, won't, it, the picture won't be right on it. And I, I seen this right here before, putting up antennas. I, I went and put one up at a bar one time, and theirs was like that. It, they had it done with a with a, uh, a antenna splitter, and one of them was bad, and one of them was good. I'm gonna show you this. Even though this is wireless, you still have to have this this nearest Aries box. That's what that is. But this thing, you know, this is on my back porch, and I'll show you. This is on my back porch, and this thing right here works. So I've tried it. I've tried it 30 feet before. It worked good. And say like you got your Xbox or PlayStation or whatever in the living room. And, you know, you're trying to watch TV. You can put one of these on there for the youngest to play in another room. And it'll send that signal to another TV. The sound, too. It's pretty good. And you can hook that up to, to any... Thing that's got an HDMI coming out, you know, like like satellite and Xbox. We we hook this thing up to my laptop and, and watch movies. Or sometimes we don't do it too much no more, but we used to do it. That's what I bought it for. Okay, now here's my security system. See, now that that's got an HDMI port coming out of the receiver going to the TV. So you can put that near is prime on that. Like I say, anything that's 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 got a port coming out, you can use that. And this right here is what I had in the back of that satellite dish whenever I was showing you. This right here, it you plug the on the satellite, satellites has got USB ports and that's what powers is. So you plug this into the USB and this goes into back into the back of whatever source you got, whether it's Xbox, it don't matter what it is. This is what you plug into it, and the the other part that I showed you is on the goes on where the signal is going to. I got a I got a full video of this Aries, and you can look at that. I'm, I'll put a link to it down there. I want to tell y'all one last thing. I, I noticed that a lot of y'all's got YouTube channels. If you want to subscribe, if you want me to subscribe to you, just let me know that you subscribe to me, and I'll I'll try to do it. It's kind of getting hard to answer the phone and and keep up with everything, the comments and everything, but I'll try my best. All right, thanks everybody.